Ninth race of the evening, third and final division of the Frank and Beth Stanfield Memorial for three-year-old pacing fillies. The first $20,000. Bella for now, Lorne Valley Barb, Woodmere Nasha, Streak Azana, Dusty Lane Zambuka, Chelsky, and Roxy Lund. They're off and uh, pacing. Lauren Valley Barb off the gate first, looking for the lead streak. Gazan on the outside is away second, followed out third as they race into the first turn by Woodmere Nasha. Then outside and traveling fourth, Dusty Lane Zambuka, fifth out the rail. That's Bella for now. Then uh, back to Chelsky and Roxy Lund is sitting at the back. They continue out of the opening quarter and quickly brushing up on the outside. Dusty Lane Zambuka is firing to the lead now as they are checking at the opening quarter. That's Dusty Lane Zambuka to take over top spot. Streak Kazana will yield to sit in the pocket second, followed by Lauren Valley Barb. Looking at it from uh, three, back in four is Woodmere Nasha. Battle for now, unhurried back in the five spot. Then a traveling sixth, that's Chelsky with one beaten. Roxy Lund as they continue off the top turn. 28 seconds was the opening quarter. They approach the halfway point, and it's Dusty Lynn Zambuka on the front end. A uh, length and a quarter is the lead. Now flush to the outside, Lauren Valley Barb quickly up alongside the leader as they race into the lower turn. And out of the 5 eights they head, Dusty Lane Zambuka being prompted along by the first up attacker. That is Lauren Valley Barb still in the pocket streak to Zana is racing third, out second over, but gap to the cover is Bella for now in four, fifth inside, that is Woodmere Dasha, 57-3 and three was the half, they're on even terms as they arrive at the three quarters, Lauren Valley Barb on the outside at the rail, Dusty Lane Zambuka, Streak Azana is a block third, outside, well spotted, second over, fourth, that is Bella for now. Woodmere Nasha is buried out the rail in five. They head past the seven eights and off the turn. 126 and one was the three quarters. Back to the lead by one is Dusty Lane Zambuka as they straighten out for the stretch drive. Streak Azani in the passing lane. Lauren Valley Barb is still there. Down the stretch they come on the inside. That is Streak Azana up to win it. Finishing second, Dusty Lane Zambuka. Looks like Lauren Valley Barb holding on to the show spot.
Well, back in the Woodmere Standardbreds winner's enclosure is the winner of the third division of the Frank and Beth Stanfield Memorial, number four, Streak Azana, Bay daughter of Western Paradise, out of the Arts Place Dam, Stonebridge, Madonna. Was bred by Raymond Primo, owned by the MCR Streak Asana Group of Charlottetown. Trained and driven by Mark Campbell, Streak Asana. Streaking to a new lifetime mark of 155 and uh, three fifths. On a victory lane, Mr. Tom Stanfield making the plaque and cooter presentation to the winning connections of Streak Asana. Winning the fastest division of the Frank and Beth Stanfield Memorial, 155 and three.